Welcome to Top Picks, your ultimate destination for the top picks of all things captivating and remarkable. Flying car ecosystem shapes up while regulators move to create the rules and regulations for personal air vehicles, EVTOL electric vertical takeoff fan landing crafts and flying taxis. The ecosystem of managing all aspects of those flying vehicles on the ground is getting underway. The flying vehicles, despite not needing a traditional runway since they take off straight up and land vertically, still need a place to do that and be serviced and maintained. From flying cars to ultra-compact electric vehicles, the weird and wonderful cars of science fiction are fast becoming reality it has taken some time, but today's cars are beginning to morph into the futuristic, self-driving machine science fiction writers were making up stories about not too long ago. What other possibilities are out there for our future cars? Take a look at four once fictional car genres that are on their way to showrooms soon. Driverless cars, once a fantasy, are also fast becoming a reality for the future of transport. Rack launched the first automated vehicle trial in Australia with the Rack Intellibus with support from the WA state government and the city of South Perth. Now, Perth is just one of three cities in the one a what time Swedish university research project has quickly become one of the world's electric mobility darlings. Uniti says its mission is not to make the best cars in the world. We're trying to make the best cars for the world. In October 2016, the company raised E1, 6 million in the first three. Uniti is targeting India and Europe first in 2019 with the one with a touring range of 150 kilometers to 300 kilometers, a top speed of 130 kilometers per hour and price of E14,900. Uniti says it will eventually offer four and five seat versions of the Uniti one, but there's no word on whether it will come to Australia. German company Lilium Aviation demonstrated a faster flying future in the skies above Munich in April 2018 with the football-shaped jet that takes off vertically, then travels horizontally, speeds up to 300 km per hour. The five-person jet is scheduled to take its first manned flight in 2019 ahead of a Uber's vision of airborne personal mobility is a long way behind other flying car visionaries. It's still at the vision stage, but claims to be on track for a 2023 vehicle launch. German company Sono Motors has developed a relatively affordable Shen a compact hatchback that uses integrated solar cells to charge its batteries, the company, which has already conducted customer test drives in Europe, says the 16,000 Shen can travel up to 30 kilometers per day on sun power alone. Hope you would have liked our video. Subscribe our channel for more amazing videos.